Warning, this is how I personally complete each project. I do have some mechanical and electrical knowledge. Use this video at your own risk. I am not and will not be responsible for any damage that may occur while you attempt to repeat as I do. Always follow all manufacturer warnings and instructions. Consult a professional if you are unsure. Daddy G Ville's World. What's up, guys? Uh, I've been asked to do videos for a while, and I haven't really done anything because I've been messing with my truck. Well, today uh, I'm putting a new stereo in my truck, and I already started this process, and I stopped midway, and I was just like, you know what? I'll make this the video and today what we're doing is just hooking the stereo up this is my test light I've got multiple test eggs but this one I actually pretty like I like that I like a lot because it has a little flashlight on the end of it and instead of just lighting up you know a white light it has indicator colors like blue for ground red for hot uh, you know positive now what this pretty much does I don't, hopefully you guys can see this it's like when I touch this right here, see it lights up red. Well, my key is off. So if this is still lighting up red when my key off, that's telling me it's a constant hot. So that's my battery wire right there. Okay. Now, see, you watch this one right here. This one here, it's off, right? Okay. Now I'm going to turn my key on. My key is on. Plug it in. It lights up red. Now, that says that goes through my ignition. If I turn my key back off, touch it again, boom, that's my ignition wire. Now, here's what I was telling you about the different colors with the grounds. Right here, this is a ground wire. See how it's lighting up blue? That's telling me that is a ground wire. Pretty much once all these are hooked up, then all you got to do is run all your wires for your speakers and all that. Now, I'm going to show you this. My truck is a mess because it's been sitting for a while. But this, now after these are all three are hooked up, it's pretty much simple. Turn on the key, and then the radio will come on. And then there we go. Radio is on. Now it's got to hook up the speakers. Now, once you, I'm going to get back to this for one second. My camera's not focusing here. Let's get that focused in there. Even though I've got these on here, I'm still going to wrap it with some tape as for an extra precaution. Always do that. I've got electrical tape up over there and everything. I'm going to show you a little trick right here uh, real quick. The reason I bought this radio was because uh, I'm going to put more uh, screens in the back. So it plays DVDs and all that. So way on long trips, instead of just listening to music, you know, because my kids are like, can we watch something? It's long. I'm bored. I'm tired. Well, well, that's the reason I got this. But one thing is you cannot drive with this radio. I'm going to put the DVD in here. You cannot drive and have this on because it has to be in park. I'm going to show you a trick. And over here, let's see. Right there. It says, warning, video viewing is not available while driving. Now, you you can do this. I'm going to show you how to do this. But if you get into an accident or something like that, you know, that's not on me. I'm just showing you how you could bypass it because if you got kids like me and you want to hook up more speakers, I'm going to hook up more speakers in the back. Now, I'm going to hook this up. You take where the parking brake wire here and I'm going to hook it to a ground. And there we go. Now you have access to that and you can watch it and all that. You can go back and forth. From your radio and everything. Oh, hell no! Are you stupid or something? But now I'm saying, now, I'm not saying do this, but if you do do it, you know, it don't come back on me. Oh, or somebody, like, cop pulls you over. Why are you watching a movie? Because, you know, I know a lot of people text on their phones and watch videos on their phones. And you're like, oh, Daddy Gville told me that. No, I did not. I told you how to do it. I didn't tell you to do it. There's two different things right there. But 
that's how you do it is this the wire for the parking brake you just ground it out to something and the screen will come on uh, but you know once it's off you know it goes back to the warning screen but you know I'm just showing you this so you know how to do it because if you're on it like I bought it so my kids can watch DVDs and you know not pester me while I'm driving well that's what I'm showing you now because that's one of the reasons that I bought it for long trips and so that's pretty much it but you know this don't come back on me but like well daddy Jivo showed me how to do it no no I showed you how to do it but I didn't tell you to do it so that's gonna be this guys uh, next video I'm getting my speakers all <coughs> excuse me <coughs> getting my speakers all hooked up right now and uh, eject this go back to the radio here and uh, yeah but that's gonna be it guys so till next video peace out be sure to like subscribe and hit that bell so you never miss a video up on imaginary problems you got to focus on what's real man